Today, what we're going to be doing is opening up a kobacha squash. Today, what we're doing is we're going to cook these artichokes. And you see how these artichokes have some burnt leaves. I'll be cutting those. What I'm going to show you is how to cook these artichokes in the Instapot. Okay, and you make sure it's that ceiling like before. And welcome to Healthy Vegan Living! I'm going to tilt this forward so you can see. You press manual. Oh, look, it's already at nine minutes. But let's pretend it wasn't. Let's say it was at 12. Then you just use the minus arrows or the plus arrows to get to the number you want. And we're only doing nine minutes. Now we're gonna wait for it to turn on. And what happens is it takes about five minutes to come to pressure and then it does its additional nine minutes. And by then it'll be ready. Then we'll naturally vent it and then we'll eat it. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. So the artichoke squash combination has just ended. So we're gonna turn off the power. And now what we're going to do is we're going to let it vent naturally for five minutes. So There's still a little bit of pressure. We're going to just slowly, we're going to fast vent. Now we're going to see if it, if it works. It'll take a, less than a minute for the lock to drop. Okay, the lock just dropped. Turn on, unscrew the cap, let the juices fall in. Put the cap in a safe place, not near the plastic because it'll melt. Okay, now let the steam go out. Now watch, you just take the fork and you'll be able to touch, go right through the kubacha, which was very, very, very hard to go through before. So now what we're going to do is carefully remove the ingredients and let it cool. Now use your scissor, scissor thongs and it's not because, and, you, and carefully move it I'm going to move it a little bit this way you can see the white bowl and carefully move it out. Now you know that the squash right now is very tender. Just try not to break it. It's not something that you would use a kumquat, uh, you use an artichoke to make broth. So it doesn't have a good enough, a, a nice enough taste to save the water. So this is gonna go in the sink. So you have no choice now but to pick up the liner with a mitt. I'm gonna go to the edge of my sink here. And get rid of this. And then put it back into your pot, your, your instant liner. Put the, the steamer back in. Put the lid back on, that way nobody gets burnt while you're assembling your food or, or your dinner. And don't forget to unplug it. And what I normally do is I remove it to a better part in my kitchen so that now I can work on the food itself. And I promised my mother a taste of this type of squash and I'm gonna give her a healthy portion because she's interested in trying out different foods. So it's still very hot right now and we're not gonna do much with it. This here will be different. I'm gonna put these in one big container and put them in the fridge. Same thing with the squash, you can watch me. And that way tonight, when I come back from all the chores I have to do, I will make a different dinner with the cooked kobacha. Thank you for watching and stay tuned. I thought you might wanna see how I'm gonna do this. So I'm taking, it's right now I can actually touch it with my hands. I'm going to take the artichoke here and put it in this larger container here.
I'm going to let this cool and later this evening I'm going to come up with a meal where I can use the artichokes and this kabocha squash that Kirk told me about to make a meal. Thank you for watching. So this is the uh, kabocha squash and the uh, artichokes that we cooked together. So what I'm going to be doing is these are just fine. I'm just going to eat them the way they are. And the kabocha squash, I'm going to put on some of the earth balance, with, which most vegans call uh, uh, vegan butter and I'm just gonna lay it over the top and so this is gonna be my dinner tonight so I'm just gonna have a simple dinner of having my my artichokes and um, the kobacha squash all right so that's it out this is uh, the end of this video and we look forward to seeing you in our next video bye bye if you like this channel please subscribe if you like this video give us a thumbs up thank you for watching